Yep, I just here from the great and back to a new Crest Team Rumble stream. And if you didn't see the last one, go and check it out. And we are continuing to level up Ripperoo. Which, yeah, I've almost gotten all of the rewards and the Rippers lost it. We're just missing, I think, one reward, which is the a volleyball. It's a volleyball bomb. A bomb that's a volley, volleyball. Or a baseball. ball. And of course, Ripper is about at level 7. He's almost at level 7. And yeah, we got all 30 marbles, pretty much. Yeah. So, pretty much no more marbles can spawn now. Because we got all the marbles. We got all the marbles. So how are y'all today? And hopefully, how are y'all with Ripperoo? How are y'all with Ripperoo? I'd like to know y'all's progress. And of course I got this emote. <laughs> Oh, he killed me. <laughs> that Ripper <Roo> killed me. I just need to get two more knockouts to get that bait ball, that bait ball one, that bait ball bowling bomb. A lot of people do find Ripperoo's kick move to probably get annoying. Which, yeah, it probably can get annoying to people. I can understand that. Got the sandstorm. I don't think those even count. Who knows? Those might not count. Again, it just says KO enemies with bowling bomb. I love Ripperoo. He's a real great character. There's so many Ripperoos. <laughs> I just love how many Ripperoos there are. I just love how many Ripperoos there are in this match. There's like five, or it feels like. It feels like five Ripper Rose. Yeah, it feels like five Ripper Rose in this match. There's just so many. It's funny.
It just... It just feels like there's like five or so reparos. <laughs> I love this ability. I love the bowling, this bowling ball. And again, if you hold, if you hold the X button or the jump button, he can bounce higher. Apparently, he is the first character to actually bounce, be the highest one to bounce. Yeah. Yeah, no other character, no other character can bounce as high as Ripperoo. Ripperoo's the, on the only character that can bounce that high, as high as he does. Feel like we're gonna win here. Oh, uh. We won. That's the one I have. Or turned on. I have that one turned on. Level seven. There we go. We got the beach ball. And if I go and look right quick, hang on, if I go and look right quick, if we go and look at the Ripper's Lost It challenges, if we go and look at it, I want to say, yeah. Look, all of Ripper's Lost It challenges have been completed. We completed all of the Ripper's Lost It challenges. And... May I remind y'all that it wasn't that long ago since the, the Ripper's Lost It challenge or event and Ripper Road came out, right? May I remind y'all... And we have already completed all the challenges. So we don't have to worry about... We don't have to worry about missing out on any of the challenges on the early access before the tents, right? So thankfully we don't have to worry about any of those challenges. Crazy to think I'm already level 7 with Ripperoo. Already level seven. <laughs> I love that noise. It's <laughs> I don't know why, it just sounds so funny though. I don't know if the stars look good or they spark sparkles. Three, two, one. I love that little bomb that is on as the backpack or as a back equipment. I really love that. Enemy 
Again, if you do, I really do love how you can just hop higher. Just by holding the X button. And shooting out the cannon, too. No, 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 no. What? <laughs> what I point it that way? That was my bad. That was on me. That was on me. I pointed it. I pointed it into the void. I'm so sorry, Ripperoo. I'm so sorry, Ripperoo. At least you can tell when Ripperoo's coming because of the the thing on the floor. Or you can actually see the target on the floor of when where he's coming. I just love that you can just get launched out of the cannon like that. It's a good escape, too. It helps you with your escape. But yeah, this is the first proper Ripper Rose stream on Team Rumble. I've been I've been definitely busy getting on art with the challenges unlocking with these challenges with Ripperoo. I can just tell you. Oh wait, I don't have any Wumpa. I just realized I don't have any Wumpa fruit collected. Oh, how did we do that? It's funny how a bowling bomb or a ball, a beach ball like this, could knock them out. I just love how many Ripper Rose there are. <laughs> I just love how many Ripper Rose there are. It's so funny seeing all these Ripper Rose. like we're not that gonna be that far from Spyro, you know? From those recent screens, from that recent screenshots of the, of the stages, you know, liking some of those screenshots. Are the screenshots linky? Liking some of those, are some new stages, you know, like from Dino Dash, Dino Dash, Offbeat, and a, of what people say, a Spyro theme. Theme stage, which it does look like a spark theme. If y'all say right here, these are some like screenshots. This one in particular is what people think of a Spyro. It's gonna be Spyros. And again, here's off bait. And then from Dino Dash from Crash 4. Oh, I just love that rubber ducky hat on. Trying to type something, <laughs> but my phone is just still going crazy. Yeah, 
yeah, it is pretty, or it does make sense that once you do complete the challenge, or the Rippers Lost It challenges, that the, the, the marbles don't spawn, right? Because again, the marbles don't spawn once you do complete them. Once you complete it. Once you complete the whole, the whole Rippers Lost It event, no more marbles will spawn. Which again, it makes sense. It makes sense. It really does make sense. Wow, one of my bone bombs actually hit somebody because I just got that thing again. I just got that that metal again, that badge again. Like man. Yeah, we've lost. Thirty. Thirty. So sometimes Sarah just just so stupid. I'm telling you. Thirty. Thirty. Thirty one. Thirty one. Lord. <laughs> Serious, so stupid. She does not listen sometimes. Like I said, it's just, he does not listen, this is, he does not listen this time. Thirty. Thirty. I'm not even gonna bother with the ones in the front. Like those, those ones on the front aren't nor not really worth trying to get.
Yeah, it's still funny how I'm already, like, level... Level 7 of 15 with... With Ripperoo. Like, it definitely did not take us long. It did not take us long. Nobody's even gotten to the relic station with our Aqua Aqua relic station. That wasn't. That wasn't a real good escape. I could just be honest. Not a not a real good escape. I love how far you can get shot though. I'm telling you. I love how far you can get shot. <laughs> I want to dispose these relics. I mean, I don't think we are gonna um, be able to get it. Oh, damn. Okay, might as well get that then. Because again, we're not gonna be able to get it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought so. Enemy, Aku, Aku. Yeah, I say they got Aku Aku. They got an Aku Aku and they're going to win for sure. And it's so helpful. It's so good. I love this cannon. I love the cannon ability. It's so good. I, I love this emote. <laughs> the overjoyed emote. It's so funny. Be my own trophy. Be reasonable.
Oh. Okay. Yeah, I love these guns here. Get me those flowers. Cross's full name is Cross Team Rumble Bandicoot. Hmm. <laughs> I love that. Man, it's just, it's just so good to play as Ripper Road, not count, not a car, not in a kart racer, right? Not in a kart racer. Am I? Am I not the only one? I mean, we never get, you never actually get to properly play as Ripper Road and not counting a kart racer, right? Not counting Nitro Field. This is really the first time he'd play as Ripper Road, not counting Nitro Field or Team, really, yeah, really Team Racing. Or whatever kart racers that he was in, right? Just feels so good. Again, his controls are just so good, too. I love Rip Rose controls. I just love just traveling with this cannon. I'm telling you. Traveling with this cannon is just so amazing. It's so good. Just getting shot out of the cannon. I tried. I tried. Enemy team boosted. Claim trap available. Your team boosted. Your team boosted. Allied claim trap. <laughs> mm. 
of course. Of course the host the host had to disconnect. <laughs> of course. Right. Of course the host had to disconnect. What's the next item? Ah, this. Electricity. <laughs> I just love this getting dizzy. I love this gun. This gun is gonna be so funny. I'm sorry, but look, his town... His town... His tongue also changes color. His tongue also changes color. Or maybe book maybe with that one. I don't know if it would I don't know if it changes color for all of the skins. Ripper Road just has such a long tongue. I'm telling you. I am telling you, he has such a long tongue. <laughs> you don't normally realize how long Rip Rose's tongue is. Until you say it, right? You do not realize how long his tongue is. Three, two. I love the noise that he makes, too. You gotta love the noise that he makes when he's just getting shot out of the cannon. He just makes such a funny noise when getting shot out of the cannon. If we're, I just thought of something too. I, I feel like we may, you know how I, I already made it, or I already mentioned that we might not have to wait for Spyro so long. We might don't have, we might not have to wait for Spyro for as long as we think. And again, going back to that picture, go back to that picture that I talked about with that castle, that new stage, that is a castle. That that also shows it too that Spyro, if 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 I'm not crazy, if I'm not crazy, Spyro could be in season two, right? Season two could be Spyro. I mean that's just guessing, but again, the stage, the lake, so in a castle that represents of what we are all thinking Spyro, and then. Of course, Alora and Hunt, or Alora, Spyro, and Ripto in the files. Yeah. Then yeah, I feel like Ripperoo, or not Ripperoo, sorry. Um. Um. I, I feel like that they will probably be coming. 
very soon. Or not very, very soon, of course. Not not anytime soon, because again, season one doesn't end until September twelfth or eleventh, somewhere around then, right? It doesn't end until September. But again, I feel like Ripperoo in in season two. I feel like in season two. Spyro will be coming. I mean, again, don't take it literally. Don't, don't take it personal. Like, guarantee. Don't take it in a guarantee. Like, don't take it in a guarantee that, oh yeah, Spyro is coming in Season 2. Just think about it, though. Just think about it. Put it in the back of your mind. Or just put it in the back of your head. Keep it in your back of, back of your head. Keep it in mind. Again, we'll discuss... I will discuss it more when it comes to closer to Season 2. Or, when it comes to talking about Season 2, we'll, we'll be waiting until when we talk about it more properly. Again, we won't talk about more... Or we won't talk about Season 2 a whole lot until sometime in September. Right? Sometime in September. Sometime a couple days before the season, the first season ends. Right? I feel like that will be the proper time to properly talk about Season 2. And of course, you never know, we could get some new info regarding the season when it gets closer. Right, when it gets closer to September. That's also another possibility. That's also another possibility. And you know what's pretty funny, though? About this wizard hat. You know what's so funny about this wizard hat? That it reminds me so much of one of the Magic Crafters. It reminds me of Magic Crafters. Yeah, it reminds me of Magic Crafters, or something you would say in Magic Crafters in Spyro 1. I don't know why, it's just something, it's just something that you would say in Spyro 1, and Dream, or, and, um, and Magic Crafters, right? I mean, again, it's probably just me, but I just like that, yeah, it looks like it. No, I did not mean to do that. I accidentally do that when I don't mean to. I accidentally press the cannon button in the, when I don't even mean to. Yeah, I don't even mean to. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Yeah, we've lost- Oh! Man, that was... Gonna be something for sure. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't even tried to get the top blocker yet. Uh, the top blocker ones. I haven't even tried to get those yet. Which, what challenges does it say? Win through the winning with Ripperoo and the badges. Or, the boast badges.
It's just so funny how fast we leveled Ripper Road. In the spam of not... Of just... Right. Of just of how... Again, the season... Or, not the, not the season, but Ripper Row just came out. Literally, not too long ago. And we're already level 7 with Ripper Row. And we've, we've already gotten the all of the Ripper's Lost It challenges done. <laughs> so, and again, keep this in mind. This is only the early access of Ripper Row. Right? Ripper Road hasn't even properly fully come out yet. Right? Ripper Road doesn't fully officially come out until the 20th. Right? Ripper Road doesn't fully officially come out until the 20th. So, keep that in mind, too. From, keep, keep that in mind from, to now, from... From now to of the early access to Ripper Rose full release, right? Because again, we're in the full, or we're in the early access of Ripper Row. Oh, there could be some tweaks. There could be some tweaks to Ripper Row when it comes to the full, or of to his full release, right? There could definitely be some tweaks for his full release. On the 20th. And of course, when bogged down, you know, that that home cooking like stage, or the Mystic Mars stage, comes out too. Because on that exact same day, the new stage comes out. The Mystic Bog themed stage. And there's gonna be some challenges regarding Mystic Bog stage, or bog down too. Challenges revolving around Dingo Dial. Challenges for Dingo Dial that there will be regarding that stage. Or for that stage. So I just love that. I really do love that. That they're doing. They're going to be doing challenges for Ripper Roo as well. I mean, Dingo Dial as well. Right? When it comes to. I mean, it does make sense, because it has Mystic Mars, or not Mystic Mark, but you know what I mean. It's pretty much his home dimension, right? It is pretty much his home dimension, so it makes sense. Mosquito Mars. Mosquito Mars is... His Dingo Dial's home dimension, so it does make sense that Dingo Dial would have his own his own challenges when his when his stage comes out. I mean, it is technic you could technically call it Dingo Dial's stage because again, like I mentioned, it's based in his dimension in Crash Four, so you could easily put it like that. You could definitely put it like that. Oh, I'm so glad I landed here. Don't you think about it, Embryo. I don't mind Ripperow's kick ability. I know a lot of people are saying that it could get annoying. But I don't mind it. I do like that he does have a kick ability. Because again, he has a strike jacket. <laughs> right? He is in a strike jacket. So, what more is he gonna... How is he going to be getting Wampa Fruit if he didn't have, if he didn't have a kick move, right? But I do like that he does have a kick move. I mean, it does, it does make sense too because he is a kangaroo, 
right? Ripperoo is a mutated kangaroo. So it does make sense. It does make sense for Ripperoo to have a said kick move. Again, it won't be long until I get my this my Simpsons game that I ordered as well. It won't be long until I get my Simpsons game that I ordered. I'm trying not to tell y'all exactly what what Simpsons game it is because I want to leave it as a surprise. But it won't be long. Which I'm I'm glad I'm. I'm glad I'm finally getting some Simpsons merch, or Simpsons stuff, because I haven't gotten any Simpsons stuff yet, so I'm glad that I'm getting, finally getting some Simpsons stuff, the Simpsons movie and a Simpsons game. It's, it's like I said, I kind of don't want to say wits, wits exactly until I get it, because I kind of want to leave it as a surprise. Yeah, I kind of want to leave it as a surprise. <laughs> I kind of want to leave it as a surprise. But it won't be long. Ripper Row versus Ripper Row. Ripper Row versus Ripper Row. I love the noises that Ripper Row makes, though. It's so funny. It's so funny of the noises that he makes. I just love these noises that he makes. It would be quite weird if Ripperoo did talk, right? It would be quite weird if Ripperoo talked. <laughs> that would be really weird, saying Ripperoo talk. Because again, Ripperoo is definitely a character that we don't say talk. So yeah, it would be really weird, really, really weird if we did see Rip Row talk. Or if Rick, Rip Row somehow talked. I know that he would never talk, of course, but it would be really weird if Rip Row somehow just started talking. Not gibberish or anything. Not gibberish, but like full on English. Full on English. Right, I'm doing full on English. And again, keep this in mind, not counting remakes. If you don't count remakes, because again, remakes don't really count, but if you don't count remakes and just count like new or 
just from the last appearance of Rip Row. That was in Crash Twin, Twin Sanity. Yeah, Rip Row's last actual appearance, not counting cameos. If you don't count cameos, if you don't count anything like that. Your team expired. If you don't count cameos or anything, then yeah, Rip Row's last appearance was, in fact, was, in fact, Twin Sanity. Back in 2004. Yeah. So, Rip Row's last proper appearance in a new game was back in Twin Sanity. <laughs> and Rip Row finally returned all these years. Rip Row has finally returned after all these years. Rip Row finally returning after all these years. Rip Row finally returns. It just feels so good to say Rip Row, to have Rip Row return, right, in a new game. It feels so good to have him finally return in a new game. Your team boosted. Perhaps nobody even scored yet. Seems like somebody would have scored. Or, on our team. I, get de I definitely would have. I definitely was surprised. We won 10 matches as Ripper Row. We we won 10 games as Ripper Row. Ten, and we about got Ripper at level eight. Level eight of fifteen. Keep in mind, he is almost to level ten of level two of level fifteen. We're on a roll. We are literally on a roll. Try to get these. <laughs> I just love to saying so many Ripper Rows. I just love saying all these Ripper Rows. It's just so funny saying all these Ripper Rows. Like I've seen three or four or so Ripper Rows. <laughs> four or three people playing as Ripper Row, not counting me. Not counting me. I seen three or so people play as Ripper Row. Or playing as Ripper Row. I mean, it's not a surprise either. It's not a surprise. It is definitely not a surprise. Those was that was Nate getting those relics.
I don't want to accidentally cannon myself out on into the void. Right, I don't want to accidentally do that. Because that would have not been good. That would have not been good if I would have accidentally did that. I'm not sure how people are going to unlock Ripper when he fully comes out. Because again, the marbles... The marbles are this one-time thing, right? The marbles are a one-time thing. So I wonder if they're gonna change it to be like how you would have unlocked the other characters, like female and trophy. Getting a certain amount of blocks, right? Getting a certain amount of scores, blocks, or whatever, right? Because again, it's definitely not gonna be marbles. Because again, marbles are this one-time event. The marbles are only for this one time event. So keep that in mind. Oh, I'm risking myself. I am risking myself by getting these crates. I mean, you have to do some risk, though. Gotta do some rest once in a while. Right, you gotta do some rest once in a while. You gotta do a risk. <laughs> I just hear so many Ripper Rose just getting shot out of the cannon. <laughs> There's so many Ripper Rose getting shot out of a cannon. I just... I just hear so many Ripper Rose being shot out of a cannon. I just love of all the... I just love of all the... <laughs> Rip Rose being, you could just hear. Nobody has really scored. <laughs> Not for a while, at least. Nobody's even scored for a while. a risk. I don't know why I used the cannon there, but... I'm telling you, nobody has scored on our team for a while, and, and the other team has called up. The other team has called up now. Nobody has scored on our side for a while, so... what you call a great finish for sure. That's what you call a great finish. Like, dang. We surely... Wow. Level 8. 
And I just love, I just love this combination, though. Yeah, let's put a bug on our head. Let's put a bug on Ripperow's head. I mean, he's a professor, right? Ripperow is a professor. He is a professor. So, or he's been, he is a professor that's been studying. So, he's, he studies all the books and stuff, so... He'll know what to do with that bug. <laughs> He'll know what to do with that bug on his head. He'll know what to do with that bug on his head. At least I'm pretty sure he should know what to do with that bug on his head. He should know at least. Hopefully. Hopefully he does. <laughs> Hopefully he does know what to do with that bug on his head. try to get some blocks in. Wait, we, right? We gotta, we gotta try to get those block challenges in. Or being top blocker. <laughs> I don't know what to, I don't know what to talk, say about that. Honestly. I don't know what to say about that. Not me till next week. Oh, what if that dead hit Coco? What if it dead hit Coco though? I'm doing good with this. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm good. I don't know if I'm gonna get the top blocker. I don't know if I'm gonna get the top blocker. Because again, those are some of the challenges for Ripper Row. The top blocker. I placed it the wrong area. <laughs> I placed it the wrong way. Yeah, we we've lost badly. We've lost badly. <laughs> like for real, we we just lost badly. Like that hurts. For real, and of course it got placed the wrong way. <laughs> of course it got placed the wrong way. Or on the wrong area. He got placed that on the wrong area. No, we didn't get top blocker. We did not get top blocker. Again, I'm trying... Of course, we've got that earn top blocker badges by knocking the most wumpo away. I feel like we're I should get a healing fridge. I feel like I should feel like we should get a healing fridge. Again, I'm I'm sure Ripper Row will figure out what to do with this bug on his head. I'm sure he'll figure out what to do. Again, at least I hope he does. At least Ripperoo... I am trusting that Ripperoo does know what he's gonna... what he's supposed to do with that bug on his head. I am going to believe that he will know what to do with it. I'm going to believe that he will... believe... or he will know what to do. going to hope that he knows what to do. kick though like when you're doing combat when you're doing combat he's got a good kick like, 
for real, he's got a good kick. When it comes to combat, he's really got a good kick. I know it's kind of bad to start kicking like this when it comes to them doing that. But what am I? What else am I supposed to do there, right? If only you fell in the lava. If you fell in the lava, though. If you fell in the lava, though. Ripperoo is very excited here. Oh yeah. Where do you think you're going? I know I'm leaving my post. I know I was leaving my post. I was leaving my post, I definitely know. There we go, got one top blocker. Another top blocker, though.
again. We're on, we're on kicking patrol. <laughs> Get it? Kicking patrol. Because, you know, Rip Road kicks. Right, because, again, you know, Rip Road kicks. another healing bridge. Both me and Dingerdial both died there. some people, we got some papes that have come in uninvited. Some peoples that has come uninvited. Dingodal are really working as a good team. For real, we we are we are a good team here. Man, that was that was not a good use of the bowling bomb. Dingerdial go. I want to know where Dingerdial went. Man, him were that went good on our team for sure. Dingerdale's back. We got our boy Dingerdale back. Man, me and Dingerdale really work as a good team. I'm telling you. We work as a good team together. Ripperoo and Dingerdial work good as a team. We make a good team. Where do you think you're going, Sarlock? Where do 
where does where does Sarlock think he's going? No, 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 no. I keep. That is something that always happens in common. It's just me pressing that button by accident. I mean, I don't even mean to. I don't even press that button meaning to on purpose. I don't even mean to do it on purpose. I don't mean to even do it on purpose. <laughs> Force field. Where do you think you're going, Embryo? Crass, do you not say the force field? <laughs> For real. It's like he does not say the force field. It's like crest, that crest did not say the force failed. <laughs> like, come on, crest. Do you not see that force field? You cannot get through it. Like, do you not see it? <laughs> like, he just, he just, that person just kept going straight into it. Into the force field. I'm telling you. I tell ya. Yeah, again, I would not be surprised if Spyro season is actually season two. I mean, there could be a possibility, right? Season two could possibly, possibly be Spyro as early as Spyro. It could be. There could be a good chance that, yeah, Spyro season could be as early as season two, as the next season, right? It could be as early as that. But again, wouldn't wouldn't put my hopes on that or anything. Wouldn't I wouldn't guarantee that yeah, it's definitely gonna be. I wouldn't I wouldn't say that. I won't say that it's definitely going to be Season 2. But there could be a possibility, especially with all these hints and teases, right? With all these hints and teases and stuff. Like, there's no doubt that... Man, that was great. <laughs> that was good.
I was quite happy with that. I know I'm leaving my post. I know I'm leaving my post. Which I was going to until I saw Cross over here pop up. I saw Cross over here. Wait, what, did my... Was my healing bridge already destroyed? Oh wait, it's invisible. Yeah, it's invisible. I think my healing bridge is invisible somehow, okay? Yeah, I just... I think my healing bridge was... Yeah! My he... My healing fridge was invisible. <laughs> Apparently it has the power to become invisible. Nope. Nope, did not mean to press that. Oh no. I mean, I had to do something, right? I had to try something. I couldn't just stand there. I know I couldn't just stand there or anything. I wouldn't be surprised if that thing or die was what was actually on my team. Really? They're going to get Uka Uka again? I mean, am I all that surprised that they're going to get Uka Uka again? Probably not. I mean, I'm not all that surprised. Say, I told you, I'm not all that surprised. I'm not all that surprised. that surprised. Not all that surprised. Still no top booster, really. <laughs> I mean, not top booster, sorry. Top blocker, for real.
three, two. Coco, you're not even gonna you're not gonna get onto the bank, right? You know that. Your team boost expired. Oh, I placed the healing bridge right when I died. <laughs> Pfft. A good use of a healing bridge though. Hello, fellow Ripperoo. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, if only that got Coco. Oh, that one did. Yeah, I ret <laughs> that was a weird way to retreat. That was kind of a weird way to retreat. Man, they destroyed that healing fridge. They destroyed that healing fridge like it was nothing. somehow disappear. It's like they just snapped me out of the arena. Like, I did not know they had that power. I didn't think they had the power to do that. Still no dot blocker. That gum.
Still no top blocker. That's crazy. Won 14 matches as Ripper O. Or in total, at least. I've won 14 matches as Ripper O in total. We'll make him a champion. <laughs> we'll make Ripperu a champion. We'll make him a champion. We'll make him a champion. Oh, dang. Fellow Ripper Oak, please help me. Hopefully my fellow Ripper Oak can help me. Hello. Hopefully a fellow Ripper Oak can help me out. Right. How did you survive? <laughs> how did she not? How did Coco not fall in the water? That's what I want to know. How did she not fall in the water? Surviving Coco. I'm I'm serious. How is Coco surviving? Okay, I'm serious. How is Coco? How is Coco surviving? Clean up on aisle three. Excuse me, female and trophy. Do you mind? Do you mind, female and trophy? There's already. So there's already one there. 
to do. Ha! Huh. Welcome, Melon Trophy. Did we pop out of nowhere? Did we give you a startle? Did we give you a startle? I wonder if we gave them a startle. Smart, Coco. A what? I'm sorry, what? Something in a what? Raccoon? I didn't really understand that. <laughs> I didn't really understand that. I would not be surprised if I don't get the top booster. I'll be, su be surprised if I don't get the top booster. But I hope we do get the top booster. Yeah. You're lucky, Finn Melon Trophy. Help me, fellow, fellow buddy. Female and Trophy does not learn know how, when to quit, does it say? Like, does say. Ha! You placed it the wrong way. Or you placed it. They placed it wrong. Wait. Okay, I was gonna say, is there... I was gonna say... Oh, we got it. And it said the fate. I heard it say the fate when, but we won. <laughs> but we won. Man, no. I'm telling you, the top booster one took forever to get. That took a long time to get. <laughs> But we got the top bo that top booster one. Oh, so close. <laughs> so close to level nine. 
So close to level 9. <laughs> so close. Lucky there. Blowing up down. Coco, go pick on something your own size. But really, there's not a whole lot of things that they could pick on their own size. Thinking about it. Right, just thinking about it. Oh, it, it turned, it transformed me. Or, 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 Cortex transformed me. Now, there's so much, there's so much happening in this area. I'm telling you, there's just so many, there's so much stuff happening in that one area. Why are you still chasing me, Cortex? I, was, I guess he wanted to get revenge. I guess he just stopped. But, in fact, I kind of don't know why he was still chasing me. Because there was really no reason. Oh, dear. I'm actually glad it doesn't um, destroy your power up, though. Get Ripper or get Dinger Dial. You too, Dinger Dial. No, that long that went. We went far there.
We'll get our revenge, though. I tried. I'm sorry. I tried. I tried. Was there a chance I could have survived down there? Not really. <laughs> Not necessarily. Not necessarily. Back away, you stupid Tante. Oh, I'm getting sought out everywhere. <laughs> I was getting sought left, right, and forth. I mean, it's probably not, probably gonna not have that for long, for sure. As long as Dingo Doll's here, though. There we go! I was just, I was trying my best to keep Dingo Dial. Up. I was trying my very best to keep Dingo Dial from just from stopping us. I was just trying my very best. Level nine. Level nine. Level nine. I got level nine. I love that.
I just love that. Wait, two. I thought I could have stopped it. No thing at all. Back. Back. You know what? I don't care. Take it. Come on, dispose those sex relics, please. Get those sex relics, please. Those five relics. Man, he knocked me good. He knocked me back far, though. Dingo Dot was scary, for sure. I mean, in, in a way of how, how strong he is, right? In a way of how strong he is. Scary, like, for real. It is just definitely something, you, a character you do not, or player, if anybody's playing as Dingo Doll, you are definitely not gonna want to mess with them. Oh no, they're gonna get they're gonna get the Spirit Guardian, aren't they? I gotta act fast. Managed to get it. Man, we're all huddled from Dingo Doll. We are all huddled from Dingo Dial. And yeah, they're still gonna win. See, I told you. I told you they were gonna win. I told you they were gonna win.
Let me see. What is a night starting for Referu? Ah, the skull. Or right, this bowling bomb. And we got the break dancing. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We gotta level Ripperos about six more times. Then he is max level. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's what we'll conclude this stream. Hit the like button, subscribe, and channel. So I guess turn on some missionary thing. Nope. Let me on thing. Catch you next one.